Well, this is it. No grander occasion in Flopson. And we're just moments away from kickoff now in the World Cup final. How do you see the match going, Stuart? Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio begins in goal. Rafael Guerrero starts with João Cancelo in the fullback positions. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And the focal point in attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. This is what they'll be up against today. Fernando Muslera is the goalkeeper. Jose Maria Jimenez plays with Diego Godin at the back. Federico Valverde plays with Rodrigo Bentancur in the centre of midfield. And in attack, Luis Suarez plays alongside Edinson Cavani. And this confrontation is underway. Ruben Neves. Diogo Jota. Ronaldo. On to Bruno Fernandes. Well, that's gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. Cristiano Ronaldo, one of the greatest players of the current era, and you'd have to imagine, Stuart, he's going to have some sort of role to play in this one. Well, it's his ability with the ball at his feet that makes him such a good player. He can go past defenders with ease, he can play in tight areas, and he has that bit of trickery as well. I'm really looking forward to seeing him play today. Well, it's been a long and winding road to the final for Portugal. It's worth remembering that they finished second. The opening goal in the final! And how important could that be as a direction pointer? Well, just look at this strike again. He hits it so well. That's a great bit of skill. No wonder he's pleased with himself. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Simple catch, really. Now, will the keeper have to pay the price for that mistake? Ruben Neves. Ronaldo. Ronaldo! Oh, a superb save. effort, so near committed challenge 
Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. Tremendously strong in the tackle. Oh, goalkeeper mistake. Will there be a price to pay? Real chance. And I think we can call him one mighty relieved goalkeeper. Well, he can smile now, but that was a big blunder. And an astute piece of defending. Bernardo Silva. Guerrero. Well, it's been a good last 15 minutes for Portugal. They're having most of the ball now and look like scoring every time they go forward. They do need to extend their lead, though, while they're playing so well. Yes, it's so true. For once, they find themselves in defensive mode. Ronaldo. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. Ruben Neves. On to Silva. Jota. A sloppy pass. Oh, did so well to deny him. Let's see about the delivery. Oh, the crossbar is still reverberating. Well, he didn't miss by all that much with the header. Just a little bit off target. Ronaldo, terrific block, and a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Can they hit on the break? Who can he pick out? Well, trailing here, but a corner it is. Delivering it. Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. Bruno Fernandes. Well, possession lost, intercepted. Promising attack, this. Cavani. Goalkeeper in charge of the situation. Trying to deliver it accurately. It hasn't come to very much. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. Well, the counter chance looks very real. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute. A chopping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Short and along the ground. Now shot happy here. And saved by the keeper. Who can they pick out? Not really the ideal clearance. Well, able to survive that attacking push. And so it is, the first half story has been written. So back underway, and an intriguing second half in prospect. Nicely timed tackle. 
Realising that it might be opening up on the opposite flank. Luis Suarez making progress with the ball at his feet. And nicely struck. And up for grabs off the keeper. Well, threat over for now. Well, that was a great save. But the way they're playing at the moment, the equaliser can't be far away now. A routine save. And strong play here. And they have possession again. Giorgian de Arascaeta. He has teammates around him. And the keeper there to deal with it. Now sending it in. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the chance. Guerrero on to Silva Ronaldo Silva Ronaldo and now Guerrero just made sure nothing came of that Bentancur It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. A really effective shielding under pressure. Could play it in. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. Ronaldo Silva. On to Ronaldo. Good effort here! Well, it wasn't all that far off the target. Well, you're absolutely right. That was close, but the game is still very much in the balance here. Substitution time it is here. Very quick thinking there. Ronaldo. And beating the defender. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back. And I have to say, the finish from Ronaldo is just brilliant. He's such a good technician. It's a wonderful goal. So the ball rolling again, 2-0 the score. Bentancur. Well, that's wonderful attacking play, but he was on his toes to win the ball back. Well, Portugal had more of the possession, as you can see, and as a result have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch, and I don't think anything's going to change that. Well, that'll be a free kick. And the yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Otavio. Very comfortable when in possession. And just narrowly wide in the end. A super tackle and they've won possession. Oh, the threat is there. Oh, my goodness, what a strike from so far out. Absolutely sensational. Unstoppable. Well, let's take another look because this is a special goal. He's so far out when he strikes it. He couldn't have hit that any better. So the action underway again here, with Portugal very much in control. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. 
Wonderful block. And he knows he must thump it away. And well, he stopped them in their tracks. Suarez, and he's broken free. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, just look at the defending here. The keeper is left totally exposed. It's an easy goal in the end, but well taken. So back underway, 3-1 the score. Ronaldo. Bruno Fernandes has it. Just the challenge that was required. And just five minutes remaining. Bad pass. And here is Luis Suarez. And doing all he can to grab his second of the game. Well, he's been a real live wire today. A constant threat to this back line. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. A well, fine reading of the situation. We've had the official word, there will be a minimum of two added minutes. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Suarez. And now it's all over. We've witnessed history. Portugal have won the World Cup for the first time. Well, they've been kings of Europe, now they're kings of the world. And I have to say, Derek, they fully deserved it. They were great today. Portugal, the world champions! And this is finally Portugal's time. Fully deserved. Best team in the world. Well, you have to give credit to the coach. He's been excellent, but so too the players and these fans. It's absolutely magnificent for them.